gonna do? What am I gonna do? I mean, this this is like a complete nightmare. Oh, I know. This must be so hard. Oh no, two women love me. They're both gorgeous and sexy. My wallet's too small for my 50s, and my diamond shoes are too tight. Hey, here's a thought, Ross. Don't touch a computer. Don't ever touch a computer. Need to know. I've never slept with someone for a part. Well, is she? Sorry. Is she good looking? Yeah. She's totally good looking. I mean, if I met her in a bar or something, I'd be buying her breakfast. <laughs> you know, after having slept with her. People, we're in trouble here. We've only got 12 hours and 36 minutes left. Move, move, move. Monica, I feel like you should have German subtitles. <laughs> Uh, this is it. This is how we're gonna die. <laughs> Ready? Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Erica. <laughs> nice camouflage, man. For a minute there, I almost didn't see you. Excuse me. Nah. -uh. <laughs> Uh, is your name Chandler? Uh, yes, yes it is. Chandler Bing. Do you know me, or are you just really good at this game? <laughs> I've met the perfect woman. What? Okay, we're sitting on her couch, we're fooling around, and then suddenly she turns to me and says, do you ever want to do it in an elevator? Oh, my God. <laughs> what did you say? I believe my exact words were, fine instant. <laughs> kind of sexy if you wore mine tonight at dinner. You want me to wear your panties? Could you? Well, if I was wearing your underwear, then uh, what would you be wearing? <laughs> You're swell. Pull my arm off just so I have something to throw at her. Thanks for trying. Oh, and by the way, there is no Count Rushmore. Yeah, then, then who's the guy that painted the faces on the mountain? <laughs> Women tell each other everything. Did you know that? <laughs> yeah. No, Chandler, everything. Like, stuff you like, stuff she likes, technique, stamina, girth. Girth? Why? 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 Why would they do this? All right, fine. You know what? We'll both sit in the chair. Fine with me. Oh, oh. I am so comfortable. Me too. In fact, I think I might be a little too comfortable. All right. <laughs> Night being a ling. Night night. Janice. <laughs> Look at all that room on her side. You could fit a giant penguin over there. Oh, sorry, did I get you? get me it's an electric drill you get me you kill me calm down have you seen joey what's the matter oh just this <laughs> you know what it's my fault really because the couch is where we usually keep the varnish hey somebody want to hand me one of those tiles what's going on he's retiling my floor you, Spacker boy. <laughs> Bathroom, living room, this right here is the kitchen, and uh, thanks for coming by. Bye-bye. Don't you, uh, don't you want to ask me any questions? 
Sure. Uh, hmm. What's up? <laughs> Who else wants one of my special homemade brownies? Uh, I will have one. Oh! Oh! oh. Yeah, I'm no, not going to have okay. one. Of <laughs> no, no, it's just my tooth. Oh, I'll have one. <laughs> so what's the matter? You need a dentist? I've got a good one. Oh, thanks, I have a good one, too. I just, I, I, I can't see him. See, that is the problem with invisible dentists. <laughs> Fun now, huh, Ross? Want to do another one? Huh, Ross? <laughs> okay, 11 letters. Atomic element number 101 ends in eum. Dysprosium. <laughs> Dysprosium. Try Mendelevium. And weenie number two has it. Unless, of course, Nine Down, Nights in White Satin was sung by the Duty Blues. <laughs> Dada. Can you say dada? Oh. Look, I'm going to tell you, Mommy, as you said it anyway, so you might as well try. No luck, huh? No. No, a while ago, I got a sa out of him, which I thought, you know, might turn into secondary caregiver, but... All right. But I'm very excited about this, okay? So yeah. you've got to promise you won't get all big brothery and judgmental. I promise. What? It's Richard Burke. Who's Richard Burke? Do doc Dr. Burke? You have a date with Dr. Burke? Why, why, why should that bother me? I, I love that man. He's like a, uh, a brother to Dad. Excuse me, your, uh, your, your wind? Yes, my wind. How do you expect me to grow if you won't let me blow? You, you know I, I don't have a... I have a, a problem with that. Ross, you are so much better for me than Paolo ever was. I mean, you care about me. You're loving. You make me laugh. Oh, hey, if I make you laugh, here's an idea. Why don't you invite Paolo over to have a little romp in the sack, and I'll just stand in the corner until knock knock your ass. <laughs> Animal sex? Animal sex? <laughs> so what are you saying? I mean, you're saying that, like, there's nothing between us animal at all? I mean, there's not even, like, um, a little animal? Not even, not even like, like, chipmunk sex? <laughs> look, look at that. Look at that. See how she's pushing him away and he won't budge? All right, I'm, I'm going to do something. You get a condo right on the mountainside. You ski in, ski out. That's great. Uh Excuse me, are you Rachel? What? Oh, Ross Geller. Well, I'm, God, in your ad you said you were pretty, but wow. What are you? What are you doing? Oh, oh my God, is this is this the wrong day? I don't believe it. Uh, well, hey, I guess if it works out, we'll we'll have someone to tell the grandkids. You sure will. <laughs> right? I've uh, got to go. Uh, okay. Take care. Okay. 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 Uh, See you later. Uh, nice meeting you. Okay, yeah, Ross, you... listen to me. I am not yours to save. But you are. What? Uh, well, you, um, you're my lobster. <laughs> okay, you know what? Are, are you being like the blind date guy again? <laughs> no, no, you're, uh, you're my lobster. See, um, lobsters, uh, in the tank when, when they're old, uh, they get with the, they walk around holding the claws. <laughs> In the tank, you know, when, <laughs> with the holding and, uh, Phoebes, you want to help me out with the, the whole lobster thing? Do the claws again. <laughs> smile. Oh, Dad, turn it off. It is off. Dad, it is not. What's with the red light? It's the off light. Right, yeah. right Ross? Looking good, Mr. Cartoon. Hey! Oh, look at you, all sexy. Really? Oh. <laughs> wow. Oh, hi. Hi. How come you didn't come over earlier? Because I'm a stupid, stupid man. Hey, Ross. Mm. Want some cider? No. 
So, uh, let's see, you're pretty close, huh? Well, makeup's on, hair's done. Yeah, I just have to get dressed. Yay. And that takes, what, just six or seven minutes? Yeah, once I figure out what I'm wearing. <laughs> Glass of fat? <laughs> Joe! Full bag? Beer's still cold? <laughs> Something terrible must have happened here. I know. Uh, how could we have let this happen seven times? <laughs> you know, look, we were away. In a foreign, romantic country. <laughs> I blame London. Bad London! <laughs> You look cute in bubbles. Nah, uh, you're just all liquored up. <laughs> hey, it's me. Coming in. <laughs> I've had a very long, hard day. Uh, I'm gonna go get some chicken. You want some? Uh, no thanks. No chicken. Bye bye then. <laughs> all right, I want only the father in here, please. Oh, oh nice. love, you. Good luck. Good luck. love you. Bye, Dan. Uh, bye, Monica. Uh, bye, Mammy Boo. <laughs> All right. You know, I don't know if you've ever looked up the term goofing around in the dictionary. Well, I have. And the technical definition is two friends who care a lot about each other and have amazing sex. <laughs> I am so bad at this. <laughs> I think you're better than you think you are. Really? <laughs> okay. So, it... No one to stop. You know, I sense that I should stop. <laughs> so we're okay? Yeah. All right, I want to go tell Dan that it's not going to happen. Don't do the dance. Right. <laughs> He's really shy. I, I don't think he's up to meeting everyone yet. Yeah, I don't think he's up to meeting everyone yet. <laughs> I don't care. I want to meet this guy who's the best sex she ever had. Really? <laughs> That's what you heard? You said that? I might have said that. <laughs> Why is that funny? Because I'm very happy for him. And you, you lucky dog. You know, I, I think I'm going to respect the privacy of my new secret boyfriend. Why? <laughs> I mean, if this guy was me, and it was me who had learned that it was me who was the best you'd ever had, I'd be going like this. I don't know. Maybe we should keep looking. Oh, but hey, Ross, this place is available now. Yeah, you don't want to be stuck with us for the next five weeks. Yeah. So you, you think I should go ahead and take this place? Oh, it's perfect! <laughs> How about you? Kitchen slash bathroom. <laughs> it's the apartment manager. Ross put us down as references. Ross is the greatest guy you'll ever meet. Yeah, he's very reliable. Of course, he has a big, huge dog that uh, barks into the night. <laughs> well, who doesn't love dogs? Uh, he's a tap dancer. Yes, some would say that is a lost art. <laughs> he's a pimp. Yes, Janice. Why is that so difficult for you to comprehend? You remember Janice, right? <laughs> yes. She was smart, she was pretty, and she honestly cared about me. Janice is my last chance to have somebody. Hello! Oh. My. God. Man, I sure miss Julie. Spanish midgets. Spanish midgets wrestling. Julie. Okay, yes, I see how you got there. Better. There's my little boy. Can I, uh, see something? 
Just a little extra air in my mouth. <laughs> hey, he was this little naked guy. Uh, that little naked guy would be me. Oh, oh <laughs> look at the little thing. Yes. <laughs> yes, fine. That is my penis. <laughs> Can we be grown-ups now? <laughs> Ooh, look, 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 look. I got Monica naked. Oh, <laughs> no, no, that would be me again. <laughs> I'm uh, just trying something. And dinner. <laughs> Thanks, Aunt Phoebe. Hey, you didn't microwave that, did you? Because it's breast milk, and you're not supposed to do that. Duh! I think I know how to heat breast milk. <laughs> okay. Go. Oh, what did you just do? I just licked my arm. What? It's, it's breast milk. <laughs> Juice squeezed from a person. What is the big deal? No, oh. no, ju ju oh my God. Yeah, What did you just do? Okay, can people stop drinking the breast milk? You won't even taste it? No. Not even if you just pretend that it's milk? Not even if Carol's breast had a picture of a missing child on it. I tasted Ben's milk and Ross freaked out. I I did not freak out. Why'd you freak out? Because it's breast milk. It's gross. My breast milk is gross? This should be fun. No, no, Carol, there's nothing wrong with it. I just, I just don't think breast milk is for adults. Come on, just taste it. <laughs> that would be no. Come on, try No. It doesn't taste bad. Yeah, it tastes kind of sweet, sort of like, uh, like what? Cantaloupe juice. Exactly. <laughs> you've tasted it. You've, you've, you've tasted it? Uh-huh. Oh, you've tasted it. <laughs> Give me the bottle. Get me the towel. Oh, actually, I haven't even been home yet. Do you mind if I check my messages? Oh, yeah, go ahead. Rach, I got a message from you. <laughs> Who's Michael? Oh, my God. Oh, my God, Ross, no, hang up the phone. Give me the phone, Ross. Give me the phone, give me the phone. Give me the phone. Give me the phone. <laughs> You're over me? Oh, God. What? You're, uh... Oh, God. You're, you're over me? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. When... Oh, when were you... under me? <laughs> oh, uh, I talked to Janice. Oh, my God. Is she going back to him? She doesn't know. Says she loves us both. You know, I woke up this morning, I was in love. You know, I was happy. You know, it serves me right for buying that 12-pack of condoms. <laughs> and now I can't even return them because she choked in the receipt. <laughs> All right, so I'm back in high school. I'm standing in the middle of the cafeteria, and I realize I am totally naked. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay, <laughs> Then I look down and I realize there is a phone there. Instead of... That's right. <laughs> Are you through with that? Yeah, sorry, the swallowing slowed me down. Whose little ball of paper is this? 
Oh, that would be mine. See, uh, I wrote a note to myself, and then I realized I didn't need the note, so I balled it up, and now I wish I was dead. <laughs> oh, hey, oh, hey don't do that. that. Oh, no, it's Ch worse than the thumb. <laughs> This is so unfair. Oh, what? why is it a big mess? So I have a flaw. Big deal. Like Joey's constant knuckle cracking isn't annoying, and Ross with his overpronouncing every single word, and Monica with that snort when she laughs. I mean, what the hell is that thing? What does she think of your little science project? <laughs> what, you think I'm going to tell a girl I like that I'm also seeing a cup? Man's got a point. Well, the tough thing is she really wants to have sex with me. Crazy bitch. I want a baby. Mm, not tonight, honey. I got an early day tomorrow. Get out. Come on, let's get some coffee. Oh, okay. Because we never do that. Why the what? <laughs> Why would you dream that? More importantly, was I any good? Well, you were pretty damn any good. <laughs> Interesting, because in my dreams, I'm surprisingly inadequate. Come back, come here, Marcel. Oh, no, no, not in my room. I'll get him. Ross, you've got to do something about the humping. What? It's, it's just a phase. Well, that's what we said about Joey. Yeah, but it was different with him today. I mean, and it, he wasn't like orthodontist guy, you know? I mean, we had fun. Is there anything wrong with that? Yes. <laughs> Why? I have my reasons. <laughs> but she said she's looking for someone, and someone is going to be there tonight. Tonight? Tonight? Well, I think it's perfect. You know, it's just going to be the two of us. She spent all day taking care of my monkey. <laughs> I can't remember the last time I got a girl to take care of my monkey. <laughs> so what are you going to do? What can I do? Look, I don't want to do anything to screw it up with Ursula. And your friend Phoebe? Well, if she's my friend, hopefully she'll understand. I mean, wouldn't you guys? Man, if you tried something like that on my birthday, you'd be staring at the business end of a hissy fit. <laughs> and uh, to you too, Helen. Nina Bookbinder is here to see you. Oh, okay, send her in. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, I know, you're a chef. I know, and I thought of you first, but um, Chandler's the one who needs a job right now, so... Yeah, I just don't have a lot of chefing experience. Unless it's an all-toast restaurant. Yes, Fran, I know what time it is, but I'm looking at the weenus and I'm not happy. <laughs> oh, Rit, 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 well, let me tell you something. You will care about it because I care about it. You got it? Good. Whoa. <laughs> I'd like to toast Ross and Emily. Of course, my big toast will be tomorrow at the wedding, so this is kind of my little toast, or, or Melba toast, if you will. Okay. <clears throat> I've known Ross for a long time. In fact, I knew him when he was uh, going out with his first girlfriend. <laughs> and I thought things were really going to work out for him until the day he overinflated her. <laughs> Here you go, Phoebe. Here you go, Fobo. Fubula, Phoebe, boo. Thank you. <laughs> you. <laughs> Hey guys, what are you doing? Oh, just planning my bachelor party with my best man. Yeah, well, good luck trying to top the last one. Yeah, see, I don't think it's going to be that difficult considering this one won't take place in the basement of a pizza hut. <laughs> well, I'm Ross, I'm Ross. I'm too good for the hut. I'm too good for the hut. Well, big deal. So Joey's had a lot of girlfriends. It doesn't mean that he's great in bed. We share a wall. <laughs> So either he's great in bed, or she just liked to agree with him a lot. Speedy, with you, it's going to be different. The sex is going to be great, because you, you guys are in love. Yeah? Yeah. Just go for it, Chandler. Yeah, you yeah. should. Come on. Really. All right, all right, I'll sleep with my girlfriend. <laughs> but I'm just doing it for you guys. Oh, no, no, you guys, come on, you don't have to do that. I'm happy for him. I am, I really, I am, I'm, I... I'll work on it. I'm sorry, honey. Mm. You're gonna come, though, aren't you? Oh, honey, I don't know. I don't... This isn't one of those, uh, you know, if she doesn't come, we, we, don't, we don't come, right? Because I already bought my ticket. And... I'm telling uh...
He broke up with Julie. <laughs> well, go hug her for God's sakes. Really? Really. It's always been you, right? <laughs> Oh. Hey, someone order a coat? Ross, Chandler wrote something about me on his computer and he won't let me see. He won't, he won't. Uh, you know what? Fine. If you guys want to be children about this, that's fine. I do not need to see it. Ah! What is this? That is, okay, um, that's that. No, no, no. It, uh... Ross, what is this? Thank you. Good luck. Okay, just just remember how crazy I am about you, okay? Kind of ditzy. <clears throat> Too into her looks. Spoiled. Now that's a little spoiled. He was supposed to type little, the idiot. <laughs> hey, Rich. I uh, got you a little present. I'll open it. It's a slinky. <laughs> Remember, huh? For walks downstairs, alone or in pairs, everyone knows it's just a big spring. <laughs> All right, you're still mad at me because of the whole horrible and degrading list of reasons not to be with me. How about from now on we just call it the unfortunate incident? <laughs> Rach, <clears throat> you know what? I think I think I know what'll make you feel better. How about you make a list about me? Forget it, Ross. No, I'm not going to stand on, here Rich, and make I a list it'll... of... Okay, you're it... whiny, you are you're obsessive, you are insecure, you're, you're gutless. <laughs> you know, you don't ever, you don't just sort of seize the day, you know? You liked me for, what, a year and you didn't do anything about it? And, uh, oh, you wear too much of that gel in your hair. <laughs> See, there you, you uh, all right, you, you did what I said. <laughs> yeah, and you know what? Hmm. You're right. I do feel better. Thank you, Ross. All right, you know how you say I never seize the day? Well, all right, even though he's your super, I'm seizing. Mr. Trigger, <laughs> here is 50 bucks. Merry Christmas. Oh, wow. I didn't get you anything. <laughs> here's five back. <laughs> no, 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 that's, that's your Christmas tip. All right, oh, hey. Do you think there's a chance uh, you can fix that radiator now? Uh, no can do. <laughs> like I told the girl, I can't get a new knob until Tuesday. Ross? Yeah? Looks like he's playing baseball. You mean hardball? <laughs> Whatever. What you gonna do? Excuse me, I'm seizing. Mm -hmm. Mr. Trigger? <clears throat> Here's another 50. Happy Hanukkah. Will, uh, will this help with the knob getting? No. The place is not open till Tuesday. Am I not saying it right? <laughs> nice seizing, gel boy. Uh, hey, Ross. <laughs> Hi, Ross. I've just got two more tables to clean and then we'll go, okay? Okay. I'll just sit here and, uh... Chat with your uh, friend type people. <laughs> Ross, 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 Ross. Hi, hi. Are you a uh, friend of Rachel's? Yes, yes, I am. Are you a uh, a friend of Rachel's? Actually, I'm uh, kind of a you know a date type thing <laughs> of Rachel. Uh, a date? Yeah, I'm her date. Oh, oh, you're, uh, you're, oh, you're the date. You are the, uh, paleontologist. Yes, yes, I am. And you are a... <laughs> periodontist. See, now they're as different as night and... later that night. <laughs> well, I am going to, uh, get a beverage. <laughs> uh, it was nice, nice, uh, meeting you. Ditto. She's dating? Yes, yes, but did you see who she was dating? <laughs> what do you mean? Do you not see it? See what? I don't know what she's seizing in that goober. <laughs> and, it, and it takes him, what, like, like, 
I don't know. Uh, uh, hello? A week to give out a sentence? Yeah, it's annoying, isn't it? <laughs> yeah? Okay, we're having some... You're swell. <laughs> Pull my arm off just so I have something to throw at her. Thanks for trying. Oh, and by the way, there is no Count Rushmore. Yeah, then, then who's the guy that painted the faces on the mountain? <laughs> Women tell each other everything. Did you know that? <laughs> yeah. No, Chandler, everything. Like, stuff you like, stuff she likes. Technique, stamina, girth. Girth? Why? 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 Why would they do this? All right, fine. You know what? We'll both sit in the chair. Fine with me. No. Oh. <laughs> I'm so comfortable. Me too. In fact, I think I might be a little too comfortable. All right. <laughs> Night, night, Janice. <laughs> Look at all that room on her side. You could fit a giant penguin over there. <laughs> oh, sorry, did I get you? No, you didn't get me. It's an electric drill. You get me, you kill me. Calm down. You seen Joey? What's the matter? Oh, just this. <laughs> you know what? It's my fault, really, because the couch is where we usually keep the varnish. Hey, somebody want to hand me one of those tiles? What's going on? He's retiling my floor. You, Specker boy. <laughs> Bathroom's an idea. Why don't you invite Paula over to have a little romp in the sack, and I'll just stand in the corner until knock knock your ass. Yes! <laughs> what? 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 You and I have is special. All Paula and I ever had was animal sex. Animal sex. <laughs> so what are you saying? I mean, you're saying that like there's nothing between us animal at all. I mean, there's not even like um. A little animal, not even, not even like, like, chipmunk sex? Look, look at that, look at that. See how she's pushing him away and he won't budge? All right, I'm, I'm gonna do something. Get a condo right on the mountainside, you ski in, ski out. It's great. Excuse me, are you Rachel? What? Oh, Ross Geller. Well, I'm, God, in your ad, you said you were pretty, but wow. What are you, what are you doing? Oh, oh my God, is this, is this the wrong day? I don't believe it. Uh, well, hey, I guess if it works out, we'll, we'll have somebody to tell the grandkids. You sure will. <laughs> I've, uh, gotta go. Uh, okay. Take care. Okay. 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 Uh, See you later. Uh, nice meeting you. Okay, yeah, Ross, you... listen to me. I am not yours to save. But you are. What? Uh, well, you, um, you're my lobster. Okay, you know what? Are, are you being like the blind date guy again? <laughs> no, no, you're, uh, you're my lobster. See, um, lobsters, uh, in the tank, when, when they're old, uh, they get with the, they walk around holding the claws. In the tank. You know, when, <laughs> with the holding and, uh, Phoebes, you want to help me out with the, the whole lobster thing? Do the claws again. Everybody smile. Oh, Dad, turn it off. It is off. No, Dad, it is not. What's with the red light? The off light. Right, yeah. right Ross? Looking good, Mr. Cartoon. Hey, hey! Live 
living room. This right here is the kitchen, and uh, thanks for coming by. Bye-bye. Don't you, uh, don't you want to ask me any questions? Sure. Uh, hmm. What's up? Who else wants one of my special homemade brownies? Uh, I will have one. Oh. Yeah, I'm not going to okay. have one of those. No, no, it's just my tooth. Oh, all right, I'll have one of those. So what's the matter? You need a dentist? I've got a good one. Oh, thanks, I have a good one, too. I just, I, I, I can't see him. See, that is the problem with invisible dentists. Fun now, huh, Ross? Want to do another one? Huh, Ross? Okay, 11 letters. Atomic element number 101 ends in eum. Dysprosium. <laughs> Dysprosium. Try Mendelevium. And weenie number two has it. Unless, of course, nine down nights in white satin was sung by the duty blues. <laughs> dada. Can you say dada? Oh. Look, I'm going to tell you mommies you said it anyway, so you might as well try. No luck, huh? No. No, a while ago I got a sah out of him which I thought, you know, might turn into secondary caregiver, but... All right. But I'm very excited about this, okay? So you've got to promise you won't get all big brothery and judgmental. I promise. What? It's Richard Burke. Who's Richard Burke? Do doc Dr. Burke? You have a date with Dr. Burke? Why, why, why should that bother me? I, I love that man. He's like a, uh, a brother to Dad. Excuse me, your, your, your wind? Yes, my wind. How do you expect me to grow if you won't let me blow? You, you know I, I don't have a, have a, a problem with that. so much better for me than Paolo ever was. I mean, you care about me. You're loving. You make me laugh. Oh, hey, if I make you laugh, here's... Hey. Oh, look at you, all sexy. Really? Oh. <laughs> wow. Oh, hi. Hi. How come you didn't come over earlier? Because I'm a stupid, stupid man. Hey, Ross. Mm. Want some cider? No. <laughs> So, uh, let's see, you're pretty close, huh? Oh, makeup's on, hair's done. Yeah, I just have to get dressed. Yay. <laughs> and that takes, what, just six or seven minutes? Yeah, once I figure out what I'm wearing. <laughs> Glass of fat? <laughs> Joe! Full bag? <laughs> Beer still cold? Something terrible must have happened here. I know. Uh, how could we have let this happen seven times? <laughs> you know, look, we were away in a foreign, romantic country. <laughs> I blame London. Bad London. You look cute in bubbles. Nah, you're just all liquored up. <laughs> hey, it's me. Come in. <laughs> I've had a very long, hard day. Uh, I'm gonna go get some chicken. You want some? Uh, no thanks. No chicken. Bye bye then. <laughs> all right, I want only your father in here, please. Oh, oh I love you. Good luck. Love, 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 love you. Bye, Dan. Uh, bye, Monica. Uh, bye, Mammy Boo. <laughs> All right. You know, I don't know if you've ever looked up the term goofing around in the dictionary. Well, I have. And the technical definition is two friends who care a lot about each other and have amazing sex. <laughs> I am so bad at this. <laughs> I think you're better than you think you are. Really? <laughs> okay. So, it... No one to stop. You know, I sense that I should... What am I going to do? What am I going to do? I mean, this, this is like a complete nightmare. Oh, I know. This must be so hard. Oh, no. Two women love me. 
They're both gorgeous and sexy. My wallet's too small for my 50s, and my diamond shoes are too tight. Hey, here's a thought, Ross. Don't touch a computer. Don't ever touch a computer. Need to know. I've never slept with someone for a part. Well, is she... Sorry. Is she good-looking? Yeah. She's totally good-looking. I mean... If I met her in a bar or something, I'd be buying her breakfast. <laughs> you know, after having slept with her. People, we're in trouble here. We've only got 12 hours and 36 minutes left. Move, move, move! Monica, I feel like you should have German subtitles. <laughs> She's coming! Uh, this is it. This is how we're gonna die. You ready? Wait, wait, wait. Oh. <laughs> Erica. Nice camouflage, man. For a minute there, I almost didn't see you. Excuse me. Nah. <laughs> Uh, is your name Chandler? Uh, yes, yes it is. Chandler Bing. Do you know me, or are you just really good at this game? <laughs> I've met the perfect woman. What? Okay, we're sitting on her couch, we're fooling around, and then suddenly she turns to me and says, do you ever want to do it in an elevator? Oh, oh wow. <laughs> What did you say? I believe my exact words were, fine instant. <laughs> kind of sexy if you wore mine tonight at dinner. You want me to wear your panties? Could you? Well, if I was wearing your underwear, then uh, what would you be wearing? 